I've been gone for a long time and I think my roommate COVID was a big part of it so it's only right that I show you guys what I did so stay tuned and I'm going to show you all the tea, all the secrets, everywhere I got it from. Spoiler alert, TK Maxx, Ikea and Argos might as well have sponsored this video because a lot of my key things are from there and an honourable shout out to Beautify and I'm going to show you everything I got, where I got it from and why those stores deserve an honourable shout out. As you can see here, this is my storage unit. I got this storage unit from Argos. These baskets, the white and the black one, are both from Argos. I've got a candle from Rituals. Jewelry kind of organizer or display is from TK Maxx. And this is from Beautify. always comes off. Oh, this is the ghetto, I'm gonna have to pull it out like this. Just so you can kind of get an idea of what's inside. Then here, lip glosses, this is from Muji. And makeup brushes that need to be washed, don't judge me. And I've got some jewelry back here, Zara perfumes which are my fave. This is from TK Maxx for like loose files, documents, papers, got my books favorite shoes if you don't know about the comme de garçon or what this is from tk max it's got hair dryer wigs and bundles and stuff here i have like nail stuff um and some cotton pads i think i'm gonna get something change all of this i don't think i want this anymore some wine because it's never a bad time for wine before this was a sweet jar and then i just thought it'd be cute to kind of put stuff in here obviously at night time you can't see the wires so this just looks a bit better but i just wanted you guys to see the lights just for effect let me just turn these off bam we're here this is a little ugly corner and in caddy where i keep all my cleaning products i think it's really important if you want to keep your room looking shiny sweet and cute have one of these on deck stuffed away in this little corner for nobody to see yeah i love this mirror mirror is bay 90 pounds nice sturdy mirror literally you can get everything in it from your head down to your feet you can get it in the picture um and i just told myself when i now that i've upgraded my room when i now upgrade my style y'all ain't ready for the pics on the ground so you better follow me it's jarida okay just like my youtube channel now if we go up here now this plant is for wilkinson's if you can see a little bit of it actually cut off which is just fantastic but that's fine um i got these really cute um storage baskets wicker baskets i guess they're called um from tk maxx both 9.99 each i really really like baskets that have those kind of dividers so i can literally separate my creams from my perfumes or my hair stuff from this and like it just keeps everything organized and easy to find in sections I got the desk from Ikea. I'll insert the price here. I really, really like the desk. I really like the fact that it's a mirror top so that I can actually wipe it down um, much, much easier. The drawer is really, really good. It's really, really deep. Like the depth of it, you can actually fit a lot in there. So um, if you want to get stuff out of the way, you can really put them nicely in the drawer. The only thing is I want to get some inserts in there so I can just organize everything in there a little bit more. Um, and just create um, a better use of the space. Just got some stationery. Dettol wipes are always needed. These are my new favorite candles. I found them in TK Maxx. This one, 349. This scent is amazing. So in case you want some amazing smelling candles, just a couple stuff here. Oh, and actually this just reminds me. I got these LED strips from Primark for two pounds. They're amazing, um, so I'll show you exactly where I've put them. Under here, you can kind of see them. You can see the light, so you can see it coming through there. 
on my desk as well you'll find this which I got from Matalan which is like a tea light holder I thought it was really really cute and I put one of those um, tea lights that I just showed you earlier in there so I got this incense from Matalan Midnight Silk and Orchid now the chair for this dresser is pretty ugly but I didn't actually buy this chair I don't know if anyone else's parents does this but my dad will come home with like weird really really weird things but somehow I'll find a home for it like this chair for example it's ugly so I'm gonna probably change the chair but it's really really comfy this beautiful plant that you see is from Lidl I got that for 11 .99. I haven't named it yet can you guys think of a name for this plant I feel like I have like a relationship with it and I haven't named my plant but I've had this for a couple months now, literally since about, what, June? I think I'll insert the snaps because I do have snaps of the whole process of the day that I got that plant. I have been wanting plants for my room. I was randomly in Lidl yesterday to get something and they're selling plants at the moment, like those long tall ones, kind of like the Ikea ones for like 12, 15 pounds. I think that's even included in the plant pot, so you already know where I'm going today, honey. I'm finally getting my plants for my room. I'm sweating, please. I really just walked. 10 minutes, almost 30 minutes with this long ass plant in my hand over my shoulders. Yeah. Oh, wow, only for 11 99 you know. Wow. This plant pot was given to me, so I don't know how much it is, but I thought the red of that matched really, really well with the red from this incense, which I got from Zara Home. Um, I cannot remember what the scent is for the life of me, but it smells amazing. This candle is also from TK Maxx. This mirror I've had forever. I don't know where it is. It's another one of those weird things that my dad came home with. I think it looks nice. It, it's always been there, but I think the plant looks really nice in front of it. Um, if it decides to focus anytime this year. I think the plant looks really nice in front of it because you can actually see the reflection of the plant in the mirror and then it just looks nice. First thing I actually got when I started to change my room around is this beautiful storage bench from a place called Beautify. Beautify is the same place where I got the makeup storage from um so yeah um this pillow is also from matalan and this throw is from tk maxx so let me just show you inside actually opens up as well and i was so excited when i got this i'll show you the snaps as well Woo! how you doing how you how you how you doing can we get into these beautiful pictures? The one on the left and right, the bigger ones, are both from Desenio, and the middle one is from Uganda, actually. My mum got it for me. And this is also from Desenio, this abstract piece. I'll let you know all the prices of everything. This is from TK Maxx, this is from Homebase, this is from Ikea, and the wardrobe is Argos. I wouldn't really recommend this wardrobe, quite cheap, you can see here, it's separating. If I pull this out, you'll be able to see. Um, I've just hung up, these are more, more like formal-ish -ish type clothes, or nicer clothes, I don't know, I've just hung some stuff up in it, I've just separated it by whites, pinks and purples and peaches, greens, blues, reds, blacks and denim and bedding up there. This frame, from, I got this years ago and this is also from TK Maxx. If you can see, the theme of my room is kind of like blacks, greys, whites and little tiny pops of colour here and there, little red there, little green there, little red there, little pop of colour there um, and a little pop of colour there. This um, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful um, lampshade that I got, this is exactly the vision that I wanted. I wanted something black and I wanted something kind of wiry. I got this from Dunelm. Then when we go underneath my bed, um, I'm a bit of a candle junkie and I love these so I got loads from TK Maxx. These are $7.99 and the recommended retail price is £20. It's a bargain. Push that back in. Here I've just got another box and this is basically got one of my electricals. I've got a lot of electricals. Got my lighting equipment, backdrop equipment, and more lighting equipment under here. The last stage of my room that needs to be completed is these ugly ass, dirty ass curtains. It's had enough, it's had a long day, it's tired of nine to five, working 60 hours a week. And these are my shelves. 
that my cousin got me and um, these are actually from Aldi and they're basically just white floating shelves I'm gonna put one up here and that's where these photos are gonna go I'm gonna change this shelf and put one white and another white so it's kind of staggered like stairs this light I actually don't like because the stand is so huge um, but it's really really good because it's flexy I can twist it turn it bend it and do all sorts and it is bright as in there's a lot of things that still need to be done I still need to get a bin like a dustbin for my room like a little bin I still need to do my curtains because they're tired retired and I need to put up my shelves that um, I have bought over here um, but it's just a matter of taking the time to actually do them when that's done I also need to get a new chair because this chair it just doesn't really fit my grown woman vibe that I'm going for if you can see what I'm going for I really hope that the pictures and the snapchat the snapchats the snapchats and everything kind of put together how my house really how my room really went from trap house to luxury okay from trap house to tantalizing yeah tra trap house to tantalizing just mwah, mwah, everything 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 even smells amazing the candles oh i hope you enjoyed your stay now you gotta get the asap <laughs>